Hello everybody, Nintendo vs Sega here, um, the M was a misspelling, but, I was M by mistake and the caps lock was on, so never mind that, um, so, let's start, and like I said before, we are going to, uh, I'm going to show you how to catch all Pokemon of the, Nova Dex to complete your Pokedex. I've done it in my Japanese. Author, I also did the other uh, charm, which is um, the shiny charm. So I, I've already done it, so I'm not going to be doing it on my American Black 2 version just because it'll take too much time. As you can see, I just beat the Elite Four in challenge mode. I changed it back to normal, like right now. But anyway, uh. Pokemon that we'll be using are uh, these Cario, these Pokemon. Um, we're not gonna be catching any one of these because most of these Pokemon have already caught. The Pokedex is pretty filled up. Okay, so let's open. So who's the full first Pokemon? Oh wait, one second. I was doing a test run, so no wonder it had. I'm, by the way, I'm only going to be doing up to 50, and then we're going to take a break. So, the first Pokemon on our list is a Snivy. Oh, this Pokemon, uh, I'll take you to the exact place where you can find a Snivy. It, it's a joke. Right over here. So, uh, Bianca, once you talk to her up here, and she talks so much. I remember not changing the text speed to fast just because I forgot about Bianca. Worst thing that ever happened to me. Oh, uh, yeah. Worst thing ever. So, you could get yourself a Snivy, uh, Tepig, or Sam, or, um, Oshawa. No matter what you do, you have to buy three versions because if you want to catch all three, you have to buy three versions. Thank God I picked Superior in my white too. I mean, in my white and um, Oshawott in my um, white too. So basically, I was all set for the thing. And in my black, I picked a Tepig. So, and black too, I also picked a Tepig. But I got a Blaziken just because Blaziken's freaking awesome. Yay. It's packed. That's because I'm going to fight someone. But, the starters, anyway, you have to do, you do have to buy three versions for that. Yeah, it's pretty sad. Most Pokemon scheme for money. Truthfully, it's a pretty good scheme. Okay, now Patrat. The reason why I started over here is for one reason. And, by the way, Patrat, do I really have to show you that? You, if you, look, you have to fight Sharon. You can find Patrat in, on anywhere in Route 19. It'll, okay, so... I've never, ever had Shaking Grass over here. It'll probably be an Audino. Or a Patrat. See, I don't even think you could catch an Audino on this route. That's how, that's how dumb it is. I'm going to try and zoom out. In the chicken grass, you can only get Patrat, even at that, which is bad, really bad. So, oh my god, this sucks, so many encounters. Okay, so there's Lollipop. What? Purloin, why did I say Lollipop? Okay, so, um... These two are the first normal Pokemon that you can catch in the Pokedex. As you can see, it directly says Tratton and Perloin. So I showed you both. Now, Pidov, uh, it's a bit harder to get. Um, but I have sworn to myself that this will take a long time to show all of you guys. And I don't have a Pokemon with Surf, so that sucks. We may have to put a, make a stop at the PC just to collect my Latios who knows Surf. And that's going to be awesome. Uh, 
Hopefully you cannot see my face. If you can, I'll be pretty mad. But don't write in the comments. So I don't think I left any eggs, but I mean I don't, it sounds so wrong. I don't think I left any Pokemon to be bred. Now I think sixty percent of the time you could encounter a watchdog right here. Um and I believe that you'll even encounter a watchdog just to continue on in the game. And they're pretty close to each other. Leopard, you can also this is like exit game thing. So Leopard you can find in this essential area. On route hi hey, how to see the route. Route two. So at route two and three you could find a a watchhog and a leopard. Now who's up next on our, oh yeah, Patra um Pitov. Now Pitov is a weird thing to actually find just because of its locality. You can find it in many, many places. Okay, so let's start with the Pitov. No, let's start you off with the Tranquil. So the Tranquil is the closest one to me right now. It's so close that it's virtually, it's virtually right over here. I think uh, Tranquil is 30% of the time, and um, Yanma, Yanma is 10% of the time. That makes the 100% system. Um, then we go into Una Pheasant. Now this Pokemon, I'll show you it up last just because it up is in a weird location. Um, I believe you can only encounter it in um, two parts of Fossey Ranch. So I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure. So now I'm just moving around in random places. Now, Una Pheasant, I believe that you can only catch an Una Pheasant. You've obviously seen it just because of Hugh. He has an Una Pheasant. You obviously have seen it. But I believe that you could catch a. I've caught an Una Pheasant here too. So the way it works is that after you beat the game, you don't need an outbreak to do this. Una Pheasant will be. Wait, let me slap on a max spell. Just because I don't want to do it right now. So let's see. Max spell. Yes. Now, uh, Livani. I'm pretty sure that Una Pheasant and Livani are like related or something. So, I'm pretty sure that they're in, oh, and no, I don't want to find any trainers, stupid trainer. Yes, got away from you. I see that patch of grass, but I don't want to go to it. So, you can find a Swaloon pretty much anywhere, but the best area is right here. You can find a couple of Swaloons there. Now, uh, my first shiny was like right here in this exact spot. I remember that because I was on the bike and I was pretty mad. So I could not stop encountering trainers. And I did not. I don't know, only had one repel. Yeah, not even a super repel. A repel. Um, I'm not sure if I had a max repel. Never mind. You can find an Una Pheasant here. It's a pretty weird location, but you can find it there. Now, um, Livani. Oh, yes. Livani is in an even weirder location. I think that you can find them in this spot after you beat the game, but I'm not 100% sure since I've never encountered one. I mean, yeah, Berg, yeah. You, you have to encounter Livani. Berg has one. But I don't think you could catch him in the game unless you get a Swadloon or a Swaddle and evolve it. Because why? I don't know why they have to make it that way. Now our next location is where you can find yourself. A Swaddle... And a pit of. A pit of, you can find pretty easily. Only nine minutes in. Uh, nine minutes in, okay, let's just go take out a Pokemon with Surf. Just because I'll need that for the end of the video. I realized two, two Pokemon, I need Surf to help you guys find it. Oh, why do you guys bother me so much with needing me to have Pokemon with Surf? Uh,. And, uh, by the way, I have all Sinnoh Pokemon and Shiny. Uh, it was an achievement I wanted to get. Uh, it was not very hard. Oh, uh, I'm so tired. 
So let's just do this fast. Now, one of these two... Okay, where is my Latios? That's weird. Oh, I know where he is. Okay, so that was pretty dumb. I passed him. He's right over... Here. Yeah, he's my HM slave. <sighs> he knows Waterfall. He has to no dive, but then I gave him something else. Now, I don't think I need Articuno right now. Articuno is not the one I'm using. Fly. So... Now keep, let's keep on going. Only 10 minutes in, that's fine. Um, this will be a pretty long video, and at the end of this, I will not be doing these videos weekly. Please, no. I am not going to be doing it. Um, now you can find find a sea waddle in this specific area. I don't think that you can find them anywhere else in this um, area. Like, I think, yeah, only on this route you can find sea waddles. But you should have seen it already. Some trainers have sea. How do you not see a sea waddle? Trainers have sea waddles. Now, pit of you could find in this specific area. Now, uh, for Pokédex completion, you should have already seen Odd and Null, but just in case you didn't, I'm skipping ahead a bit. But Odd and Null, you can just find anywhere. It's, it isn't even an option. You have to find Odd and Null, no matter where you go. There's always going to be a trainer with Odd and Null that you're always going to stumble upon it in the grass. Unless you never go in the grass and never find any trainers, then why are you even playing Pokemon? <clears throat> you have to catch them all. Yeah, that's kind of the truth. Okay, now, Sunkern, I do believe that it's very close. But first, let me show you Lillipop, since it's, I, I'm already here. Lillipop you can just find here. Anywhere on the ranch, he's very common. What's rare is a Rayulu? Um, I think he's 10%. He's the rarest. The no, Dunsparce is 5%. That's the rarest. Now, some current you can find here in this central area. Okay, running into another Patrat, probably. Oh no, another Odino. Oh, that's cool. Yes. And then the Sun of Flora. I don't think that you could get it in the game. So you, <coughs> you can just use a sunstone and evolve your sun turn if you're too lazy. By the way, if you're starting off the game, there's a Pokeball right here. I already collected it. Um, so, oh yeah, this doubt one line. Okay, so all of um, the entire line you can find in one pretty good area. I usually hunt there. Back to Strident City, yay! No, I'm not happy. Just because I have... I am not feeling very good, and I'm doing this video for you guys. Uh, probably uh, This is Monday today, so I'll probably post it tomorrow. Uh, it's going to take so long. This is going to be like a 20-minute video, so... You know YouTube, they want to mess with you. Now I'm going to use up all of my max repels. I have to buy some more later. I don't know if I left them, Pokemon or not. So a good area is right here. You could get some Herdiards. I'm pretty sure that you can. If you can't, then, um, I believe if you just go, well, I'm pretty sure it's over here. It means you can get a uh, Stoutman and a Herdiard right here. Um, and what I meant by Herdiard not being over here, I meant in this specific grass area. Okay, so, you can find both of them there. But, um, but Stoutman, you'll need to encounter him in rustling grass. Now, um, a lot of these Pokemon are in Flossity Ranch, so many. Okay, so I've already shown you Audino. Okay, now Dunsparce. Um, I'll go show you if I can. Now, Dunsparce, you can also find, find his Flossity Ranch. Then, essentially, you'd be like, what? You can find a Dunsparce there? That's so awesome! Because Dunsparce can learn some pretty good moves. Um, but the thing is that, uh, when I started the game, I didn't even know Dunsparce was there. I just ran into him. My mistake. And then I ended up trading him with my friends for Ryulu, which was a shiny. My friend is not very smart. And that's how I got my level 100 Lucario. Yeah. He's my buddy. Yeah, but truthfully, Mechabal is my favorite on my team. 
He's done so much. Anyway, so, um, that's where you can find the shaking grass. Oh, no, you can find the shaking grass. Duh. Then you can find, um, Marie. Marie is 5%, I believe, or 10%. It's pretty rare, but if you want to, you can find it. Um, it's as rare as Lucario, as Ryula. Why did, would I say, Luc if Lucario was here, then you'd just beat the game. You just beat the game. <laughs> Sorry, it knows a lot of good moves, you just beat the game. Um, Ryulu, you can find over here. Marie, you can virtually see them right there. You can't catch them, but you can see them. They're pretty close. Now, Flaffy, I do believe, uh, I don't remember where... You have to go to catch him. That's the only problem. I don't remember. Um, Ryulu, you cannot get any shortcuts. You have to actually make him evolve. Meryl, uh, where, where was Meryl? I, oh, yeah, I think I know where Meryl is. Uh, I'll show you. Uh, and I forgot where Azumarill is. Sorry, guys. But Golduck is in another area, too. I'll show you. A little bit. Uh, but Flaffy is actually pretty good. So is Ampharos. But I don't think that you could get shortcuts with Ampharos. I think you could catch Flaffy somewhere. Now, I will show you how to get yourself a Meryl in Flossity Ranch. And you're like, hey, I'll, you only get a Zoomerill in Flossity Ranch. That is also true. But once you get Surf, and you're like, wait, once you get Surf, you would not even want to come back here. It's because these Pokemon are so under level. Which is true. I'm not saying that uh, you guys are wrong, but there's a place where you could get a Meryl right here. Pretty low leveled Meryl, but if you want to catch him, I'm pretty sure it's a guy, so it's pretty good. I have not caught him. I'm not trying to catch him. I, I don't know why, but Meryl, he gets you in Toga P. Like the three Stooges kind of things are never appealed to me. I don't like them. So there's a hidden grotto right here. I, I don't, I have not tampered with this. There should be a Meryl right over here. Oh, I'm blocking it. So right there. If you came here first, you'll always get a Meryl. Then you'll get a Pokeball or something. Then it randomly gets generated. But I think oh, your first time always you'll get a Meryl. A Zoomerol, I believe that you could get underneath a bridge. I'm not sure which bridge, but I know it's under a bridge. Man, I suck at remembering things. Um, yeah. And Golduck, I actually remember this. Good for me, right? I don't lose subscribers. Um, uh, where is it? It's in Honolulu City. It's pretty far from our destiny. Oh, Ma Azumarill was in Hon- Oh, I get it now. Uh, both of them are in the same area. Uh, oh, and Sidek, you can also find Flossy Ranch. It's weird, but you can. Uh, oh my god, are you kidding me? Wait, what? Why do you have a guy next to you? That's weird. No offense to anyone. I'm not even going to say it because it's kind of offensive. No, no, but like, not in that way. Uh, how do I explain it? The guy, um, the veteran says he always walks alone, that he'll never have anyone by his side. No people will be at his side. And then he has a guy who's taking photos with. So that's kind of weird. Am I running into odd nose everywhere? Are you kidding me? Level 40. You know, if I was level 60, then that would be pretty good. But I'm a level 100, so I don't need you. If it didn't let me go, I'll just pound it to death with Dark Pulse. Or, I guess Stone Edge would do better. Uh, or Aura Sphere. But you can find yourself a Gold Duck or a Zoom Rail. Uh, wait one second. What's the name of this route? Route 22. Yeah, so this is going to take quite a while. But I am ready to do this because you guys are worth it. Now... Who else is on our list? Because now we can just fly there. I think the worst is gone. Uh, I'm so tired. Still, I'm tired. So, 
Okay, we're in the 30s, which is good. Really good. Okay. Yes. We're almost done. Okay, good. We're done for the day, probably, pretty soon. Now, 20 minutes. That's pretty much how long it's going to be. 20 minutes. And we're going to fly ourselves to Nacarian City. It's because the next Pokemon we have to get are the... <sighs> monkeys. How fun is that? No one likes them. They're just annoying. They can they can counter every starter, yet they are not starters. They're posers. Poser. So you can get the monkeys ten percent of the time in the grass. I know it's ten percent just because um I I think I found ten shaking grass when I was training of my uh, seal. This is to complete my Pokedex and near a wall rain. I don't know why I could not look at that. But what happened is, out of 10 chicken grasses, I got one pan sage. By the way, you can evolve your um, Eevee into a Leafeon by that stone. We'll get to that later. Uh, so where's... Alright, so this... It's pretty annoying how to get there. But there's... No, it isn't annoying. Um... You can find any of them shaking in the grass, I believe, in this area. Not on the outer side. I don't think in the outer side. I think you get a seismic toad 10% of the time. And then you can just evolve them with stones, like the leaf stone, the fire stone, and the water stone. So, yeah, so just do that. Is it because I'm pretty sure that you could find it somewhere else? <coughs> but it isn't worth it. Okay. Sorry, my mom just told me to shut off the AC. I'm just. Yeah, so. 22 minutes in, I think we could finish this video. Okay, so. um, I already told you about the elemental monkeys. Okay, Venipede. But first, let me tell you about Whirla and Skulla. You can find Whirlapede in the. um, It's virtually there all the time. In Pinwheel Forest, and Scalopede is in the Shaking Grass, I think 20% of the time. Uh, you will either get a Scalopede or, uh, I don't know, most of the time. It's very rare, rarely you'll get a monkey. You could just find the Hashimoto or whatever the name is. Yeah, and then you could just complete it. You know, I'm just gonna take the shortcut. I am getting sick of going from Velocity Ranch. I'm gonna I'm gonna go to Vertibank City. Is gonna think uh, my agony ends there. Uh, yeah. Still a lot more to go. Well, a lot not a lot more, but a lot more travel. Uh so many master pals need to buy more. Pokemon outbreak at Route Nine. Don't care. I already have Route Nine Pokemon. I think it was a Natu. Okay, so um. You could catch a Venipede over here. It won't take too long. And by the way, you actually do have to see it it's because it's in Roxy's gym. So, you can catch it there. Uh, sorry guys if this video is kind of lame. But I don't care, just because I'm so tired. Now, uh, I'm so tired, but I have to do this for, for the subscribers. Uh, let's do this. Uh, the final five Pokemon. Uh, why? That's all I can say. Why? You could get yourselves a Magnemite and a Weezing. I mean, not a Weezing. Coughing right here. Now, you guys don't really want that. Is it because you guys want the evol ev when they evolve? You want a Magneton, a Magnezone, and a Weez and a wheezing, so um, I'm gonna give you that. Zachrom will have to fly us there, though. It's the closest thing we could get there is by Nuva, my town. And why don't? Why haven't you seen these yet? You should have seen these already. It's not even funny. You should have. Okay, so in Nuva, my town, you have to go in your bicycle. I just keep on riding. Now, uh, I'm glad I have so many max repels. Yes. See? So nice. 
Now, my HM slave will take us there. Now, I know that could be a Milotic, but I already have a Milotic, so I don't need that anymore. Okay, so let's go to my bicycle. Mm. Okay, so we're almost done with the first 50, which is good. Only five more episodes of my agony trying to show you all Pokédex completion. But it's kind of fun. It means, yeah. Now, the reason why I'm using a Max Pro is that I don't want to show you guys any Pokemon that is not meant to be shown on this episode. Oh, yeah. That pushes me back. I haven't been here in a while. I've, of course, I fight colorless all the time. But I haven't been here in quite a while, though. Oh, and by the way, uh, I'm going to have a walkthrough. Um... Well, white, but white too, but in challenge mode. So that should be interesting. Me losing to Sharon more than 82 million times. Yeah, it should be plenty fulfilling. Um, so we're almost yes. That will probably be the last Max Pel till we get there. So many Max Pels wasted. Now you can find Crash for Wake right here. He acts all weird as normal. And then you can find the Magma Stone right here if you haven't already. And I'm not going to Strange House. I was in there for like three hours. I did not know what to do. And that song finally hit me like Lavender Town. Um, the Castellia Tower did not really affect me. But the Lavender Town th theme song really did. It was weird. Do, do, do. I even forgot the tune. I've never played Pokemon Red and got back to Lavender Town. Now you could get yourselves a Magneton and a Weezing right here in this area. And in the Shaking Grass, you could either get a Pokemon that it's also very close to Magneton, but it evolves from a black and white Pokemon. I'm not going to say the name right now just because I don't want to give out spoilers. You should have already known what it is. But in the Shaking Grass, you could get yourself. I don't even care anymore. Clang, clang. But, um, that's 50% of the, well, not 50, like 40% of the time you get yourself a clang, clang. Uh, and then 10% of the time you get yourself a magnezone and shaking grass. And like 6, like 50% of the time you'll get yourself an Audino. So, thanks for watching. That was 30 minutes long. <sighs> and that was only part one. Good for me, right? Anyway, so, we stop at Magneton, and it's, and as you can see, you can see the area. You can actually see, it's, you can, it can only be found here. Magneton, only be found there. Magnoid, it can be found there. And Weezing, you can see, it's, it can only be found there. So, I'm not making this up. It's actually true. It can only be found in the P2 lab, unless you evolve it. So, thanks for watching, guys. Um, the next part will be up later. Like, never. Yeah, see you guys. I will be um, giving my way to the challenge key, and then we will be on our way. So, thank you for everyone who actually kept on watching this. A 30 minute long video, I know I would have tuned out. Yeah, so, thanks for watching, please subscribe, write a cool comment, press like, see you later, Nintendo vs. Sega, signing out. Oh, and by the way, probably in two weeks, I messed that up, didn't I? Nintendo vs. Sega, signing out, peace.